All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching The Eminence and Shadow Season 2, Episode 2. In the last episode, Sid and Claire arrived at the Lawless City. Um, Claire was there because she won the competition, and now she's here to vampire hunt, I believe. Um, and Sid is here kind of on the same reason because he was dragged here by her, but also he is here because of the money flowing into the city. Um, and he's going to kind of deal with that or see what the reason is behind it or take the money. I didn't properly understand that. Um, and now the the red moon has rised or yeah, rised upon the city. Um, the city seems to have vampires and ghouls in it. But now the red moon has kind of like caused the ghouls to go feral and start biting everyone. Um, he met a vampire hunter called Mary, who kind of looks like one of the leaders in the city. We've got a, like a white leader, black leader, and a red leader. Um, and she kind of has she ha she has the same hair, she has the same eyes. So I'm thinking they're probably related. Um, but yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing how that's going to go. Um, he also saved a. Uh, prostitute I guess um, and maybe she'll join she was like fuck this I'm out of here I'm not the same with all these ghouls around rightfully so um, so maybe she'll join Shadow Garden or maybe she'll be like a prominent character in the future I don't know overall very excited for this episode so as always guys if you're new to the channel please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well and let's go into this episode right now oh is this a guy that's like there was like God in the tower okay Damn, bro got fucked up. Oh, by this guy. Oh, it's Goldie and that guy. Run away! The Black Tower Juggernaut, the Tyrant. And then what was their name? Something, the White Fox? Yukime, the Spirit Fox. Okay. What were you just saying? You said you want to fight anyone? Oh, and then Shadow shows up. Here comes Himothy. At least, at least they know who he is. Damn, boy. Is he really going to say this again? Is this all he's going to say for like two episodes straight? <laughs> oh, she's aware of that. Okay. You don't sense any power? Can you just not sense his level of power? He's about to get dusted. They split him in half. Take his other arm. <laughs> he's still walking. Oh, well, got his torso as well. Wow. Is he a ghoul or a vampire? Can't he regenerate? Is that not a thing? Should be a thing. <laughs> I swear to God, Sid. What in the actual fuck? <laughs> right? Me for real. What you looking at, Bea? What kind of door is that? Huh? <laughs> oh, I'm already done with this. <laughs> the Scooby-Doo crew coming in right here. One of them is Sid's sister. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's how you know her. Okay. <laughs> Wait, did it? Did this girl's eyes color changed? I swear they were red in the last episode. Am I being gaslit? Oh shit, Rose is here. <laughs> the look on her face, like, yeah, sure, whatever. Yeah. Thousand year rule. Thousand year old rumor. Is she a half vampire? I didn't really answer the question, Beta, but you do you. <laughs> Rose, you need to relax. Uh, 
Uh, me personally, I would have questioned that outburst more, but yeah, sure, whatever. Oh, that hit, hit Mary deep. What was that about? I feel like I'm just gonna keep calling her Rose. I don't. I don't want to keep saying. I don't want to say six six six. More syllables. It just sounds just sounds odd every time she says it. Just say Rose. <laughs> I mean, obviously, when you join Shadow God and you you leave your name behind, of course. I'm just saying. <laughs> Oh, you got to pierce the heart to kill a vampire? I know that shit's with wooden stakes. You're not going to question how she's manipulating her own blood, Claire? No? Okay. Oh, I wonder what that is. Jesus Christ, what was that? The base on that. <laughs> Who is it? Is it Sid? Oh, no, it's not. Who's this? Oh, my God. Oh, it was a vampire, it's fine. <laughs> this guy's strong as hell. Look at these guys! In these stereotypical vampire cloaks. Why does this... Why does Juggernaut want the uh, vampire queen? Is it because of the ghouls? Lost number, number five and number three. Wow. He knows you're there. Oh, buddy! Bat face? Damn, did he just punch the shit out of Claire? Jesus Christ, man. Oh, shit. Did he cut her? What the fuck is that? Who stabbed you? Oh, damn, Claire. Well, that's, yeah, that's that's definitely a fatal wound. Unless she's a vampire. Been so long since you took damage like that. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, for a kiss? I'd rather you bit my neck. Damn, that was a pretty cool healing. Even healed your clothes. So they, I was wondering, he, he said that damn bat. Yeah, there we go. Oh shit, what ability you got? Oh shit, bro. He's like, fight first, ask questions later, Jesus. Come on, Shadow. Oh, let's go. He stepped onto your blade? Gee, bro, you just sent him flying. Well, you just made an enemy. But I mean, he was about to kill Claire. I swear to God, if these are the actual only words he says this episode, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Wait, he didn't say that last episode, did he? They are of awakening is near. Did he? Oh, I'm getting confused now. I don't think he did. Oh, yeah, her eyes are different now. Yeah, it's only when she's doing vampire shit. I just, I would definitely rather someone bite into my neck than my lip. I don't know, I feel like that would hurt way more. She wanted to keep it all secret, now she's an open book, okay. So I'm guessing, from the sounds of it, the Blood Queen is probably her mom. Oh my god, ow. I hate anything to do with wrists. You learned that the weakness was the sun? How long did that take you? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So if they don't suck blood, they can live in the sun. Cool. Oh, so this is Elizabeth. Yeah, she's got the same red hair as well. Oh, shit. She looks very, I mean, she's not young, she's a vampire, but she, she has the body of, well, someone young in the show, I guess. I was expecting, like, an older woman. Older looking woman. Oh, yeah, the red moon. Oh, 
Jesus Christ. Oh, this is Mary, okay. Maybe she's not related to her then? She's just a servant? Damn. So you gotta pull the knife out and she'll revive? I'm guessing they can only revive her in a blood moon. Ah, okay. Wait, is that her? Blood Queen? I thought she would, like, just not raw or anything. Possessed by what, huh? She does love his brother, even though he's a pain in the ass. Oh no, Scale actually got turned into a ghoul! Oh shit, then they're gonna have to reverse this, aren't they? And they were roommates. <laughs> he came looking here for treasure. You think you ran into your sister, so you wasn't you wasn't trying to save her? Pan go? Fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the digger Epsilon. Damn. Can you live 300 years? You are merely human. <laughs> That's funny. The named characters would be Mary and Claire in this case. Fucking Sid. Well, at least at least the fucking frenziest begun bullshit isn't the only thing he says this episode. <laughs> it's Gashi. Wait, who the hell is this? Okay, yeah, this is the person they were talking about. Definitely not Sid. Is Sid just gonna wa- No, There's no fucking way. That is the funniest shit I've ever fucking seen. Oh my god. There is no way they just dusted this vampire guy in one go. <laughs> fucking Sid, man. He's ridiculous. Bro, it's the fact that he just quick timed that shit. He didn't even say the I am atomic or anything. He just blitzed him in like 10 seconds. In the, the last minute of the episode, bro, that is hilarious. Sid will never not be funny. Oh my God. Uh, <laughs> I thought, I really thought that was going to be the big bad. Maybe if this queen gets revived, which she may be, she, it's looking like she will. Um, she might be a bit of a challenge for Sid. Um, considering she's going to be probably be in feral mode because of the red moon. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe that. I can't believe that. Well, no, I actually can't believe it. It's so Sid, but like, that's just so funny. I love when anime like just forgets the tropes and just boom, character dead. Man, great episode. <laughs> Definitely looking forward to the next. I, that, that's just, that really hit me. That's making me giggle. But yeah, anyway guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Uh, look forward to next week's reaction as well. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.